So far, we have done a lot of work on this physical data model. But before we go ahead and generate our database tables, we need to make sure that our design is optimal and doesn't allow redundant or duplicated data. Because redundancy increases the size of our database and complicates the insert, update, and delete operations. For example, if the name of someone is repeated in many different places and they decide to change their name, we'll have to update several different places. Otherwise, we'll have inconsistent data. And this is bad because it gives us invalid reports. So that's where normalization comes to the rescue. Normalization is the process of reviewing our design and ensuring that it follows a few predefined rules that prevent data duplication. There are basically seven rules, also called seven normal forms, and each rule assumes that you have applied the previous rules. Now, for almost 99% of the applications, you only need to apply the first three normal forms, and that's what you're going to learn in this section. You really don't have to worry about the other normal forms. So over the next few lectures, I'm going to explain each normal form, and then I will give you a simple pragmatic advice that helps you easily create normalized databases without having to remember any of these rules. So next, let's take a look at the first normal form.